bracken and briar roses turn. Um, so this is only their second session. Um, so all I'm doing here is, if I can find my clicker, going to get them used to that idea of pepper. Again, I might see if they can come towards my hand. We'll see how they go for that, but they are much, much more flighty than the other two. They're not nearly as confident. Um, and it does require some confidence and it does require some resilience to the idea that they're not always going to get the click. Obviously at this stage, all they've got to do is move in the general direction and they'll get it. Um, but again, I just want to build it up slowly because these are flight animals, they're in a pair, and these two are not nearly as brave as their sisters. See, she doesn't even take that from me then. I don't know if you can see, but there's a little flinch from Bright Roses talking to Bramble and Bluebell who are in the room behind me isn't helping anything. Okay. Oh, she wants it. Ah, oh, she's taking it, yes. That is the first stage, obviously. If they won't take it, and they're obviously a little bit too worried. Now we'll see if Bracken can even eat anything. She's a little flinch still at the... Right, they click. So, very, very flighty. Let's give them a little bit more time to get used to their surroundings. Bracken and Briar Rose, although they're half sisters of the other, the other two, they are two weeks younger, and I think at the breeder they had a lot less handling um, by the sounds of it. So they're just playing a bit of catch up on, on the other two anyway. But they generally seem to settle quite nicely after a little while, not very long. Um, so we'll just see. That was Briar Rose actually eating some. There, she's taking it from me now, so that's good. Bracken's coming towards me, which is lovely to see. Still not quite taking any. So I might just work with her sister while she's getting used to life. Yeah, I know you can probably... Bracken can fit out these holes. That's how much smaller Bracken, Bracken is. So there we go. Something to work on aware of. Now this is again one of those things that I always say if, if the pups are too worried about life um, or taking too much interest in their surroundings it's very very difficult for them concentrate on training which is exactly what Bracken's having at the moment. She's a little bit flighty, she's a little bit worried, she's still concentrating on for some reason escaping. Um, this is the same type of cage as she's got in front of hers. Um, she actually does have a bit of card cordex coming up. Um, but um, she's obviously just a little bit more worried in this setup. So I'm not really that interested in the little bits that are hanging around at the bottom. If they take it, they take them. More the idea that the click and a treat is presented. She thought about it. Yes, she took it. So Bracken just took it then, which is lovely. So there we are. Bracken's now able. Is happy enough to um, actually look at trees. So there we go, that's how long it took her to calm down. Unlike the other two, but by this stage, were actually following my hand around, they were doing the target stick, so obviously they've had one session more than these two. But even so, if you look back to Bramble and Bluebell's second session, 
um, they were much happier than these two. It just goes to show. And you know, personality will come into it as well. These four had the same dad but different mum. And that will make a difference. Hi Rose, you're not stealing Bracken Street, are you? Yes, this is lovely now. really happy with this. So obviously they're not doing anything, they're not coming towards me or coming towards anything, but compared to at the beginning when they weren't even wanting to take anything, I'm really happy. How do you do my cage, little monkey? Oh, she's off. She's a little monkey. <laughs> wow, you need to get a new cage. Give them some more peppers to um, hopefully um, distract.